Okay there, Tallyo chaps. And as some of you may know, I recently upgraded my SSD from a Dell XPS 15. I upgraded it to the Samsung 950 Pro. And in this video, I'm gonna show you the speed differences between the two. So if you wanna have a look at my video on how I actually replaced the SSD, click on the link above, you'll see. Now, I'll just say how I configured it. When I reinstalled the Windows on this SSD, the upgraded one, I configured it in the RAID mode. So that's in the SATA mode. And if you look on the screen here, you'll be able to see what I mean by RAID mode. You've got two choices. You've got AHCI and you've got RAID mode. Now, I don't think RAID is NVMe. I don't think this computer supports NVMe, but I just left it on RAID because the actual original SSD was installed on RAID. So I left it like that. So anyway, let's have a look at the speed compared to the uh, original stock SSD. Now here you can see on the right you'll see the 950 Pro speeds and on the left on the text pad you will see um, the speeds from the actually these are the speeds from the one terabyte model the standard SSD you get in the Dell XPS 15 and these numbers come from mobile tech review the video they done on the Dell XPS 15, the review they done, I'll leave a link in the description to that. So you'll see that these numbers are not made up and it's actually from the one terabyte model SSD. So it's actually the fastest one you can get. So uh, it's amazing to see how much faster the, um, the 950 Pro is over the stock one. And as you can see, how much faster the 950 Pro is, you'll see that the read speeds are around 47% faster on the 950 Pro over the stock version. And you'll see that the write speeds are around 40% faster. So it's definitely a worthy upgrade. So there you have it. Um, definitely worth buying this Samsung 950 Pro in my books. So it is what it is. And I'll see you next time, chaps. Tell you.